Thank you, Mr. Chair. Members, this is the Technology Transparency Act. Uh, this bill creates three important privacy rights for Floridians, uh, specifically when they interact online. And here's what those are. When we're talking about a company that makes over $1 billion in gross revenue and de derives 50%, excuse me, and either derives 50% of that from ad sales or has a smart speaker device, it gives the Florida consumer the right to know what type of information that company collects, sells, or shares about them. It gives the consumer the right to delete or correct that information. And it gives the Florida consumer the right to opt out of their information being sold or shared. For applicable companies that have a smart speaker device, it requires the consumer to opt in before the collection of their personal information. And for applicable companies that operate search engines, it requires transparency about how search results are prioritized. Any company in violation of the law would be liable to the Attorney General under Florida's Deceptive and Unfair Trade Practices Act with up to $50,000 civil penalty per violation, which can be tripled if the violation involves a company that refuses to delete your information or continues to sell or share your information after you've asked them to stop. The Attorney General might, may grant a 50-day cure period unless the violation involves a child under the age of 18, and this bill does not establish a private right of action. The Tech Transparency Act also says that government employees may not use their position or any state resources to communicate with a social media platform to request content or accounts be removed unless it is related to the commission of a crime, and that, members, is the bill.